Under legendary coach Vince Lombardi, the Green Bay Packers of the 1960s won three world championships and the first two Super Bowls in league history. And Hall of Fame defensive end Willie Davis was part of Green Bay's winning tradition. Green Bay turned out to be really the best thing that could have ever happened to me. There's no question that the championships were, were the high point. If you remember, my old coach said winning is the only thing. Well, <laughs> yeah, in Green Bay, winning is the only thing. There are more comparisons to Lombardi probably today than any coach in, in, in the league. The Packer-Bear rivalry is, is un, unchallenged as being probably the biggest rivalry in football. I played for three of the greatest coaches that the game of football has ever had in America. I played for Eddie Robinson, who to this day is the winningest coach ever in college football. I played for Paul Brown, who probably created most of the standards that exist in the NFL today. And of course, I played for Lombardi. There was no way the celebration uh, could have ever happened at Green Bay under Coach Lombardi. By the time you get it into a dance and signing autographs and everything else, I mean, you know, to me, that is, that is so far from where I think uh, the, the game should be focused. Playing football was a true fulfillment for me. I, I, there's nothing in my life that's been more instrumental to me than, than football. Willie Davis continues to own a Packers record with 21 fumble recoveries. But if you were to ask the opposition what Willie Davis owns a record for, it would be headaches and sleepless nights, especially by quarterbacks trying to avoid his clutches on the gridiron every Sunday afternoon. Reporting from Cougar Canyon Field in Santa Clarita, I'm John Cooperman, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.